just in in front of the one of the key positions on the higher ground where my brother Butch had his platoon, 10 platoon, and Mocker Tracy, who was subsequently awarded the MC, he, he had the 11 platoon. They in turns occupied this position and they withstood something like 30 or 40 separate attacks by the Japanese company and two company attacks. And when the chaff, our chaff force came through, uh, some weeks later, when the Japanese were forced to withdraw, they counted 350 graves in front of this, this position. So for 350 killed, there would be at least a thousand that would have been wounded. So these are casualties that just two platoons of our battalion inflicted. We're looking forward to meeting the Japanese over the mountains just ahead of us. And we had little campfires and we had sing-alongs. My brother, who was a platoon commander of 10 platoon, he invited me up from, as I was an intelligence officer of battalion at that stage, from battalion headquarters. So he'd come up and I sang a few songs of, our, of his, his favourites and what his platoon liked. And uh, I can well remember that in those moments while I was singing, I just had that feeling, premonition, that dear old Butch, my brother, whom I loved so much, that, that he was going to be killed. And it just, it was a strange feeling, but it was something that lived in my memory. And I never dreamt that a couple of weeks later that I'd hold him in my arms at Ishurava uh, for about four hours while he, he died his hand in mine and we talked about some of our good days and our bad days. C5? C5? E27. Be right down. Today it, it was it was different. I just wasn't sure how I'd react. When I when I stood in in front of Butcher's grave, I had a wreath which uh, Ruth had arranged for me, and. It's, things started to come flooding back. I saw my mum and dad's name at the bottom of the tombstone and it, it brought back memories of mum and dad telling me afterwards when I got back how uh, they'd received the telegram that Butch had been killed and I was missing in action. Fortunately, they got another telegram the second day that, that, I, that I'd reported back when I was away five days. But it, it brought back memories of, of our times together and the love that I had for him because we were, we were particularly close. We were four boys, but we were the two youngest and we'd be through many scraps, scraps together. Uh, what else can I say? When you go home, tell them of us. Tell them that for your tomorrow, we gave our today. <laughs>